Hello everybody, Timsky here and today I want to show you a game called Rise of Legends which is a real time strategy game in which you can build your own decks consisting of 12 cards they can be the same or they can be different and these cards are from up to 2 from 4 legions so there are 4 legions in this game black, green, white and blue and in this uh, video I will show you the green white deck that I made and it's not very strong but I need to unlock all of these cards yet so you play with what you got right and in this deck I will have these soldiers that will be the core of my army and I also have three spawners for, for these soldiers so these four cards are spawners with these square things here I will have two green spells that are mass root, some random green ranged at attacking units and archers and also a sapling bush. Okay so let's jump into the game and see what this is all about. Okay so I'm here at the top of the map. Let's put two soldiers partners and I will start the game by putting a partner a sapling bush over here because the first player to get to this point gets a free turret. So now I will have a turret that has three shots and deals 100 damage. So this turret can kill these two guys. And my army is coming through, so I will use these spawns to get some more units and let's rush and kill this, this tower. Let's block like these guys, let them finish the tower and I have 600, uh, I have up to 600 mana for all these cards. These void banes are really good at, at killing these soldiers. So I might. So this might be a really hard matchup. And he just spawned. Guy in a very bad spot. And now we have another turret, so we have three turrets. And our opponent has zero. And he has skeletons that just went to die. I will let this guy go to, to the range of the turret, and now I can spawn some more units with this. And I am up to 1300. Essence, so I can build another spawner. This Nexus has only limited ammo, so after it runs out, it will no longer deal any damage. And as I said, these Void Banes are so strong 400 HP compared to 36 HP of my soldiers. So this is like unkillable for me. They need to go to the turret. And die. I don't have enough bullets for them. Let's put some ranged units because these guys deal area of effect damage. I need another sapling and I have enough for the next spawner here. And let's get the soldiers rolling. I will slow them down a little bit. So my units attack these void veins. And now I'm in my opponent's base and he has zero 
bullets. So he can try to defend it, but I have more units than him. So it's too late for him probably, or if we can get a good void bands with another with some buffs and they can defend but it was not enough the, the, these guys were too late and this is how a match looks and of course that is just a quick look at the game we have all of these cards to unlock and we can try many different decks this game was pretty short so it's not like every game is that some games last 10 minutes maybe but usually they end pretty quickly what do we also have here what do we have here some ranks bronze silver and gold this is not like in league of legends that uh, you have these ranks but this is the rating of your deck if in your deck is a gold card that means your deck is a gold deck and if you have silver and no gold cards your deck is silver you have bronze and zero silver and gold cards your deck is bronze so you have <clears throat> you can get on these three different ranks with three different decks but for now of course i don't have many cards unlocked so I'm playing I think with the um, with the bronze one and let's play another game so I will start the game with putting my spawners on these fields and on this on this grid and each this circle oh I need to plant my plant and uh, over time these circles are activated and each unit on the circle is then spawned. And I think he is getting a big army. So I need to make an army myself. Let's use another entangle. And we need some ranged unit also. Then I will put this. Okay, so he was too late with the stun. He stunned by units after his units died, so it was too late. But he has all these void banes which are much stronger than my units and I think I'm lost already I have close to zero mana this turret has no bullets left and I can just destroy all my stuff maybe I can use this turret as a tank and get some arrow damage to them so they can attack the turret but my units will attack them instead and this is 86 hp and the root deals only 12 damage so i cannot kill them These guys are full HP and will just destroy me. I will try to use my my Nexus as a tank to get some damage to absorb some damage. And let's also use the root.
to he freezed all my units. So rude. Okay, we are pushing back, which is great. We'll probably die on this next couple of turrets. Because again, these void paints are so strong. Another 12 damage to them, not so, not so many. Okay, I will get this tower, which is pretty nice. Or oh, maybe not. Let's stun them. We need more archers. Maybe another sapling. And different liners also. If we have mana we shall use it. And now I have pretty sizable army. We have a couple of turrets ahead. And then Nexus he has two of the first worm spawner, skeletons and also the footmen. Now yeah, let's get some more units. It is not worth to cast a spell on just a couple of units. It's better used to just get more units myself. Okay, I can stun these. Now I'm getting a critical mass of, of units. This Nexus has 30 shots, so he will kill 30 of them. But I also have these saplings that just can get some shots. Okay. Let's stun them. So my units attack the Nexus and this is it, a second game. Pretty, pretty cool. We almost died there. But somehow we got there. So maybe I will get these Void Banes and try them out later. And this will be the first video from Oh, I need to change the layout. This will be the first video from Rise of Legions. Thank you for watching. Uh, feel free to add me to the game so we can we can play together if you wish. If you don't, that's fine as well. So thank you for watching and bye bye.